uh, when I was about 16 years old, my aunt gave me Sense and Sensibility as a VHS, and I would watch it over and over again. I, I knew the whole movie by heart, and I really absolutely loved it. And when I was in New York, uh, I was walking along the beach, and um, I saw Kate Winslet. And I went up to her and I was like, I absolutely loved you in that film, and I know the whole film by heart. And she looked at me, smiled, and said dryly, well, then you probably know it better than I do. Um, I came across this book uh, called Mother Tongue by Bill Bryson because I'm always on the look for, for new words and obscure words and uh, the English language has just a tremendous amount of, of strange words that you can hardly really put into conversation but they're just fun to know and uh, those books by Bill Bryson I just I love them after I read Mother Tongue which was all about the English language and the different words um, I read At Home and he, Neither Here Nor There and all of the books that he, he's written and um, in one book there was a reference to another book called Last Chance to See by Douglas Adams and so Douglas Adams goes around uh, the planet just um, documenting animals that are uh, going to be extinct possibly and so he went to Komodo and uh, wrote about the Komodo dragons which are quite nasty creatures and uh, so he he took a photograph of a Komodo dragon head first in, in this burrow and it says Komodo dragons sleep head first in large burrows and it's a very 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 bad idea to even think of pulling its tail so that's that was the one line that really stuck in my head that's cool.